Hello everybody, how are you doing? Welcome back to Danny's Win. Today we're gonna talk about a lot of new add-ons and resources for Blender. This is my first video after a long time of break, but don't worry, I'm gonna start making more videos now, tutorials, updates about Blender, free add-on, free resource for Blender, and maybe some other applications and software that I use. And also I'm working on a Gundam animation that's gonna come out at the end of this month, so stay tuned for that. But for now, let's move to the first item. So now we are looking at the slime add-on. This add-on really helps you when creating a lot of slimes effect between objects. It is a geometry node so it is procedural and help a lot with performance. Also since it is a procedural effect, you can control a lot of its parameters which is a great thing. So you can make your own look, you can make your own unique spin with it. Also this is almost look like the cable add-on but it is quite unique enough to be its own add-on. And you can get it from his Gumroad page, which you can find the link down below. Same with everything that I'm talking about, you can get the link down below in the description. So go ahead and get it and try it for yourself. Go to his YouTube channel and watch the video tutorial. And so let's continue to the IV Pen. The IV Pen is a great, great add-on if you're working on a nature set or if you're working on architecture render, be it exterior or interior, even though it's mostly used for exterior, but it's good for interior too for the background scene or for the run down destroyed building stuff and it's really pretty easy to use you just select the object pick the object as the base with the add-on then you can straight away draw on the object and it will create a curve for the iv then you can manipulate tons of stuff a lot really a lot of stuff to create your own kind unique and look of the iv you can also change the leaves object to your own object which opens up a lot of new possibilities for it which you guys really have to try it for yourself to see how great it is okay go ahead to the gumroad page it is from the same person that makes the first add-on the slime add-on so you guys can go ahead and check it out and download it and try it for yourself and as always the link is in the description down below this is blend tune add-on which is very simple yet very very powerful this add-on is for anyone that are working on an npr or comic or cartoony style scene or renders or anyone that might be working on this field or anyone that might need this this is a very good free add-on which give you a material library that has a lot almost any type of cartoonist material you can use it for npr scene comic scene cartoony scenes and japanese style render and there's nothing much really i can talk about this because this is a very good you can modify a lot of his material you guys just have to try it on your own because this is super awesome man super awesome now this is the neon text add-on from cg blender or blender hub this is the same creator of the blend tune add-on the one before it's also a free add-on which you can support them by donating to them and you can get it on the gumroad page also this add-on is very very useful if you are going to work on anything neon or cyberpunk style things or theme this is very useful you can turn any text into a neon text it also has tons of preset icons which you can add your own icons to it the material is pretty great it works on ev it works on anything and overall a very very useful add-ons just get the link down below get it try it this one is quick snap add-on this is basically a one-stop snapping add-on for you this has tons and tons of features regarding snapping basically which you can check on its youtube channel you can get the link to the add-on down below in the description this add-on works in object mode and edit mode which means it is very versatile it can be used for most of your snapping needs so go ahead and get the add-on and try it for yourself you can disable it anytime you want this is free add-on but i'm very recommending it for you to at least try it now we get a super blender file this is not an add-on this is a blender file with a geometry node template for a braids this is a braid generator you can make braids any type of braids you want with this you can later on edit the material to make whatever type of hair shades you want npr realistic cartoonist comics and anything you want but you can make the base braids hair with this generator there is nothing else to say about this you need to try it out i tried it out and it is super awesome you can also use this to learn how to use the geometry nodes which is also a plus a bonus a really really good bonus and yeah so just check it out try it download it from the link down in the description down below i said down twice whatever let's move on 
And so yeah, that concludes the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It will help the channel a lot. And I will keep making more videos from now on. I know I've been in Hiatsu for a long time, almost a year now, because I'm working on a lot of things. But right now I'm working on an animation, a Gundam animation or Gundam animation, you know. You can expect that to be finished soon, maybe in the end of this month. But until then, I will keep making videos maybe once a week, twice a week about any updates with Blender, any updates with add-ons, any new free add-ons, any new resource for Blender. And yeah, stay tuned and goodbye.